So this is Windows 10 camera on the Lumia 1020, which you don't normally find that combination. I'm focused in on a relatively distant house. This is about three times where Lumia camera would normally take it. Um, you can go through to digital zoom in video mode. It's a bit fiddly. Uh, that's as far as it will go, so that's probably about five times, six times. Pretty stable though. Now this is with digital stabilization turned on, which is a feature you only really find in the Windows 10 camera. Lumia camera does not have this. That's pretty stable and pretty good zoom. And to my eyes on the screen, it looks uh, reasonably clear when oh, the sun's coming out. Let's switch over to Lumia camera with just the, the OIS. We are so not quite as zoomed in. This is Lumia camera is more clever in the way in which it maxes out the zoom to just one to one on the sensor. And this is with just OIS, either hardware stabilization. Lumia camera doesn't have any digital stabilization. And for comparison, we're going to go back to look at the detail, by the way, and uh, compare that in your mind as we switch back to Windows 10 camera with the digital stabilization added to the OIS. And back at uh, maximum zoom, maximum quasi digital zoom on Windows 10 camera with the digital stabilization as well. And noticeable is that my hands are getting a bit tired from holding the phone up. Um, so it's doing quite a good job. Let's zoom out to roughly where the, uh, the pure view zoom, the, the limit of one to one on the sensor that Lumia camera was using. And again we'll cut back from this to Lumia camera itself with just just the OIS. And now we ask this back again, finally with Lumia camera, just the OIS. And we'll look at the differences in detail and stability. DIS, OIS, etc, etc, TTL.